Hi guys, this is Daniel from FND. In this video, I'm going to show you how to remove pimples and acne and also how to soften your skin without destroying your skin texture. So let's get started. So this is the image I'm going to use for this tutorial purpose. First, we need to remove the redness from the face for that duplicate this image ctrl plus j to duplicate and add a hue and saturation adjustment layer now zoom in click on here and click on your pimples area and it will automatically change the range to red temporarily increase the hue to the maximum and also saturation to the maximum now adjust this slider to affect only the pimples and acne area. Now make the saturation to zero and also the hue value to zero. Now we are going to remove the redness from the pimple area. We need to increase the hue value. Something like this works and also Increase the lightness value a little bit. Also saturation a little bit. So let's see. This is the before and this is the after. We just removed the redness from the pimple areas. You can also see the redness from the lip area also removed. We need to bring back the red color in the lip area. So click on this raster mask and select the brush tool with black color. Zoom in. Make sure the hardness is in 0% and brush it over the lips area to bring back this redness. Let's see before and after. This is the before and this is the after. If you want, you can also reduce the hue value a little bit. I'm going to reduce a little bit. This one looks good. Now select these two layers and right click and merge these layers. Now we are going to remove pimples. For that, I'm going to use the uh, tool called Spot Healing Brush Tool. Select it and also reduce the hardness of this brush to 0%. Zoom in and increase the brush size and tap on the pimple area to remove the pimples. This will take some time. And now we just remove pimples from the face using spot healing brush tool. Let's see the before and after. This is the before and this is the after. Now we are going to soften the skin. Control plus J to duplicate and go to image adjustment and invert. And change this blending mode to vivid light. And go to filter, other and high pass. Change the radius to 24 pixels. Click on OK. Now go to filter and blur and Gaussian blur. Change the value according to your image. Only focus on the face. So value 4.5 is looking good for this image. Your image may differ. If you go lower value, your face will be more softened. We don't want that. So I'm going to go with 4.5. And click on OK. Now we need to make this only affect the face. For that, add a raster mask. 
invert this raster mask control plus i to invert now select the brush tool make sure the hardness is in 0% change the color to white and brush it over the face region reduce the flow to 50% and brush it over the skin area don't brush on the eyebrow eyes and the lip area Also, don't brush it on the edges. Also, don't brush it on the smile lines. So, this is the before and this is the after. You can see the how the skin is softened. You can reduce the opacity a little bit. I'm going to go with 80%. So that's it. Now I'm going to color correct this image, make a new layer from visible and go to image auto contrast and add a new raster mask and select the black color as a foreground color and do it like this. So this is the before and this is the after. Now we can also add little bit redness to this face. Like we can add some redness in the chin area. So I'm going to add a hue and saturation in the red range. Make the saturation a little bit higher. Control plus I to invert this raster mask. And change the foreground color as white. And make the flow something like 25 and add a little bit redness so this is without redness and this is with redness mild changes only so that's it this is how we can remove acne or pimples and also soften skin in photo p so thanks for watching if you like this video give thumbs up subscribe the channel for more future tutorials also press the bell icon so that you can get instant notification when i upload your video thanks for watching bye